something that struck me from your book was the reaction that you got from, from your colleagues and fellow journalists that are covering the same sport. Can you, can you tell us more about yeah. that? I mean, everybody at the time would have felt I was, I was kind of, you know, a little bit mad almost. You know, they would have thought, how can this guy do this? I mean, we had, I got 39 emails following that first piece and all 39 were negative. They were telling me I had done something terrible. How dare I, you know, how dare I question Lance Armstrong as a champion after he had come back from cancer. This is a great story. You should see it as a great story. They were being told by Jean-Marie Leblanc, the organizer of the Tour de France, this is a great story. UCI were saying, this is a great story. The public were saying, this is a great story. Television, of course, was saying, this is a brilliant story. So when you get all of that, you suddenly realize my own feeling is not that important here. I must reflect the general mood. Now, my argument to all the journalists would be, don't do that. The general mood may be wrong. Think what everybody else is thinking and you'll be okay. Well, that's not a good way to operate. And my feeling was, I don't believe it and I don't care how many others do believe it. I'm sticking to my guns here. For more videos like this, go to youtube.com forward slash GCN.